Shelby knew, well she didn't really know that I was a young carer but she could see that we'd been friends for a while and she could see that I was like struggling with something so she asked me what was going on and I told her that I had to look after one of my family members so I started going here and then that's basically how we met Dieter and how we met Shane and how I met everyone else. My pockets was opened up to us as a, um, a way of expressing emotions but in song when you do get that opportunity, you, you can just have to do it no matter what you think, no matter what everyone says. I didn't know it would be put on the radio though. No, oh, we, we did not no, I, did, I, did, I didn't think that at the start. We didn't even think like this would be happening ever. At the start, I wasn't involved in any way. Like, for me, the music thing was like people who were like, confident. And for me, that was no, no. But then when they started talking about releasing their emotions, I was like, whoa, that really like seemed like something that I could do because like for me songs they're all about emotions I can't just like write a song without emotion in me so it was like nice like we just had a session where we just sat down me and Shelby and Shauna and Archie just talked about our emotions and it really helped like bring the song together. Shelby came up with most of the ideas but Kylie and Phoebe came up with some of their ideas and like over time that it went wrong I like piped up and said, this is wrong, we need to put it right. So like, so if it didn't make sense, I'd say it didn't make sense. I'd just put myself out there instead of being afraid to say. We didn't know Peter or Shane, obviously. Um, and these two random guys came in and started singing with us. At first I was like, yeah. okay, this is weird. And then <laughs> you, you start like, it turns out um, they, they actually they support you yeah, with your feelings, like they don't go no, they go okay. They listen to you instead of contradicting you. Yeah. I guess it was kind of nice as well because I had my, both my siblings there and they were right in their emotions so it's like kind of realising how they feel as well as they find out how you feel. Uh, I guess I'll look after my mum uh, because of her ep epilepsy. I wasn't always a young carer until like last year and um, yeah she just dropped in a seizure. When I realised there was this place, it wasn't scary no more because I knew there was people there to help. You can tell them how you feel but sometimes you can't really tell your family because if you're feeling that way, imagine how they're feeling. So we went over to the doctors and they said that he had autism. So obviously I had to start like kind of being like a second mum to him and sort of like making sure like he didn't have a meltdown again and if he did have a meltdown that I was there to make sure like I don't know, just to make sure like he didn't bang his head on something or like something like that. Just to sort of make sure he was safe. There was one time where there was this talent show at school and I sang at it and then I felt so confident and then. But for some reason like when my mum went into hospital like every part of me that I wanted to sing just like disappeared and it was like really hard for me. And even though I wanted to sing, I got so shy singing in front of people. But like maybe after a few weeks of doing my, my pockets for the song, like I finally did sing and for me that was like a big thing. Because I didn't really tell my dad how I felt. I didn't really tell my mum how I felt but and then I did and now they realise and I realised what's going on so we can we we can actually connect instead of argue because we're not telling each other stuff. We still argue a little bit but not as much. And now we're sort of like better as a mother daughter teen. I think it's like a really good thing to like express your emotions and not keep them bottled up. I never actually thought about it because I didn't think music could work but it actually does. These people that we didn't know, they'd come to us and said we've heard your song, we like it, we want to put it on the radio for like <laughs> thousands of people to hear. So it was like, oh, okay then. And since I've wrote this song, I can, I can always write another one. I'm a bit more confident now than I was before. Um, I don't really care what people think or say when I did before. It's just more about proving yourself, really. So like, if people say to you, you can't do this, you can't do that, and then to do something like this, it's just like, it's not proving anyone else that you can do things, it's proving it to yourself. We're always together and we're always, well, sometimes we're thinking of like new songs to write. And if we think of anything, we'll obviously include Kylie and Shauna and Archie and everyone. I guess when we when we used to see each other in school, we'd be 
uh, she goes to our youth group, but now it's that's our friend. So it's actually brought us closer. I wanna find 